Today is February 24th. It's about 64 degrees out today. Beautiful day and the bees are out and about. This is hive number one and this hive is looking really strong. So I'm, I'm really happy about that. Unfortunately, hive number, hive number two didn't make it through the winter. I was hopeful because when I was looking at it yesterday, which was also a warm day, there were bees flying in and out of the hive. Not too many. And uh, basically the bees that were flying in that hive were robber bees. They were just going in that hive to get any honey or sugar or anything that might be in there. So uh, that hive is definitely dead. And in a minute, we'll take that hive apart and I'll show you what it looks like. The, the bottom of the, the hive is just full of dead bees. But I'm optimistic because this hive is looking really strong. So now the plan is to let this hive get stronger as we get into spring. And then maybe in the middle of April, we'll be able to split the hive. So anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at the, the hive that didn't make it. There's still honey left in this hive. Here's one of the robber bees just taking honey from the hive, but this is all capped honey. So they didn't starve to death. This is another heavy frame, a lot of honey. This is all capped honey. And on this side, there's more capped honey. When we split the hive, this will definitely help the, the new hive take off. This is a pretty heavy frame, a lot of honey in this frame still. You can see the bees going after the honey. So this hive with the honey in it and the comb already drawn is really going to help out the new hive when we split the hive. More honey in this bar. And there's honey in this bar also. Okay, I'm going to take this box off and we'll take a look in the lower box. There's all the dead bees. I don't know if I can find the queen in there, but she's probably in here somewhere. Okay, well that was from a few days ago and it's warm out again and the bees are out and about and I think that hive is going to do really well. So that's, that's good news. And it's really nice actually to see the bees this early in the season. I've never had bees this early in the spring because I've never had a hive make it through the winter. And it's pretty cool. They're on all the little maple buds and also to see the bees going back in the hive with pollen on their legs. So it's, it's really cool. A couple things I want to talk about. One is I heard a uh, podcast the other day I thought was pretty interesting. Turns out that James Hatfield from Metallica is a beekeeper. I didn't know that. Somebody sent me uh, a link to the Joe Rogan podcast and it's about a 14 minute interview, interview and I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, everybody's talking about new YouTube changes. If you want to be notified when I post new content, you have to go to that subscriber button and hit that little bell and if you see the little uh, wavy lines by the bell that means you get notified when I whenever I post anything new I just started a patreon page you can check that out I'll have a link in the description I just made another mallet I'm having so much fun with that lathe I made kind of an artsy little video with different lighting and uh, I put that mallet up for eBay so uh, if you want to check that out I'll put a link to the eBay auction in the description so that's what's going on with the bees springs really starting to come on here in New Jersey and uh, it's getting me kind of excited to do some outdoor projects so uh, thanks again for tuning in and I'll see you soon